So, he gets the Tanya treatment. Hmm. Okay. I guess we're going back to the past and start figuring out how to alter the future and save the waifu. That was until our boy woke up again. Turns out he can, for a time, go back to the past to alter a small portion of events that could have huge consequences back in the present. As it has not been revealed yet how his time travel works, we don't have much to work on, but only ascertain that a near-death experience is one catalyst for it, though hopefully he doesn't have to do that over and over just to return to the past. Given our story setup, I actually like it. I can already see the foundations of a good anime and I have no doubts about its source material winning multiple awards prior to this adaptation. With everything said and done, I have high hopes for Tokyo Revengers and may we, the audience, get an experience worth remembering.